<laughs> but I believe a baker uses just a few ingredients. Um, and I believe that they know how to use them simply. And I, know, I believe that they know how to use them with respect. Um, I feel like a really good baker um, isn't bored of flour and isn't bored of sugar and isn't bored of salt and isn't bored of butter. Um, that they just know that through process, they can make an entirely different thing every single day using five ingredients. Um, I also think that um, a baker, which is different from a pastry chef, has to make things that people crave every single day. It's different when you're a pastry chef. You get to make something that somebody's going to have once a week, once a month, once a year. I have to make something that you're going to want three to four times every single week so I can have a business, you know, and I can pay the people who work for me. Um, I feel like what people crave is donuts and croissants and, um, you know, chocolate cake and apple pie, you know? And that's, you know, it's the same thing. I mean, it's the things that you grow up in, grow up with, and it's, it's your comfort food, and it's the things that you feel comforted by. Um, and I, I, it is my job um, to make things that you crave. Um, I personally don't often crave like a white chocolate box filled with like pop rocks and like, you know, oozing some sort of like a foamy, I don't know, strawberry thing. Um, that's just not what I wake up craving. I generally want like a piece of bacon and maybe like a scone and like a latte. But, um, but I am boring. And once again, I'm just telling you how I feel about this. Um, I believe oftentimes that it's harder actually to make something that looks simple on a plate. I think that it's, it's easier to kind of make a plate that's very ungepotched and you kind of lose what's happening inside. Um, but it's really hard if all you have on a cake is a piece of pie or a piece of tart or, you know what I mean? It better be good because that's all you have. You know, it's like walking in naked. You know, it's like, this is what you got, you know? You can't, you can gussy it up as much as you want, but it's like, boom, this is, this is it. I haven't been to the gym. I have a two and a half year old and this is what you get, you know? Um, but, uh, where am I? Um, I think that, um, the more I listened to what Christina was saying, it was funny, I was thinking about what I wrote, and, and I, I kept saying, a good baker, a good baker, a good baker, but a really good, I think, a traditional baker, and I think that's what I am. I'm just kind of a very traditional baker, and I think that my job um, is to make really good apple pie, and um, is to show people that or is to believe that people are not sick of apple pie, that you don't need to like kick it up a notch with like some rosemary and, you know, black pepper and cayenne pepper and, you know, <laughs> bacon fat and, you know what I mean? It's like, it's good. It's been around for an awfully long time for a reason, you know? And it's really good. You just have to make it very, very well. And I think that that is the hardest thing about making pie or making any of these things is that you actually have to make it well or don't make it, you know what I mean? It's fine. Come to my place. I'll make it for you. <laughs> you know?